Hello everyone and welcome to this week's update video. Today is a very exciting update you guys. The new Yorvik ponies are here and they are at a super cheap price that made my jaw drop. 350 star coins each. That's insane enough. Uh, there's also um, the Happy Horse Week where your horses get free stable care for 7 days. Which is another great thing, but another cool thing they added uh, today is uh, that now you can jump in like certain cities like Jarlaheim and um, Silverglade where before you couldn't do that. And uh, this also, because of this, means that non-star riders can now jump. They don't have to do the quest where you have to become a star rider. And I'm sure most of you know this quest, but it's just such an awesome update. I am absolutely in love with the ponies. I actually went ahead on my two alternative accounts and actually uh, bought uh, two ponies on there. But I think you guys, we are going to buy all three today. They are just too cute to resist and a, a price that you cannot ignore. So I'm going to stop talking. Let's go. <coughs> Alright you guys, but before we get to the ponies, I wanted to actually give a shout out to Kelly Water Watcher from Frost Valley. She came all the way to Night Star to say hello to me, so a huge shout out to her and her future YouTube channel, which I'm very excited for. And I wish her all the best of luck with that. Alright you guys, here we are, and I think I'm going to go start off with the pony that we got from that uh, we made on Star Stable Live. Alright you guys, so this is the first pony we're gonna look at. It's the Star Stable Live pony and I adore how this one came out. He's just so perfect. His markings are just like everything. The swirl mark and the uniqueness. I absolutely adore this pony and the thing is with uh, the Jorvik ponies, they're unique to Jorvik. They're not like any other uh, pony in the world and I just think he is stunning He's probably one of my favorite out of the three um, So we are going to go ahead and get him first um, But before I do I will say this I do love how Star Stable did the uh, live stream um, Choices and look at him. He turned out so cute He's just so worth it and he everything I wanted he got it was put into this pony, and I think um, our wonderful designer, Lisa, did just an excellent job. So let's go ahead and get him. So I already have a name picked out for him. Just a matter of finding it. There it is. Summer magic, I, I think it really fits him well. So, we're gonna go ahead and get him. He will be the first pony that I get. Okay, so I think the next one we are going to check out is this cute little chestnut one, the one that we saw in um, the original spoiler before we knew about, uh, about um, we were gonna design a pony on the live stream. And this guy is just too cute. I love the little, um, spots, um, down the, uh, dorsal, uh, his little, uh, not dorsal, uh, dorsal stripe, what am I talking about? Um, little, uh, it's a stripe, that's what it is, that's what it is. I'm sorry guys, I can't talk, uh, but we are going to get him as well. The only thing is, I, uh, I actually did have a name picked out for him, but now that I'm seeing him in game, I really don't like that name. Uh, so this might take a while, so bear with me. Okay, so I chose the name Red Pepper for him. I think it really does fit him, and it's kind of summerish. Uh, so yeah, I like it. So we are going to go with it. 
Alright guys, last one. Are you ready for this? It is the cute, adorable, and if I could click on it, that would be great. Ah, uh, come on. There we go. The cute, adorable, dapple gray. Alright, so l let me talk about this for a second. On um, my Instagram, I kind of went on with this theory that it wasn't going to be a black and it definitely wasn't going to be a bay because of the live stream. And Black Bay, Palomino, those were the options. So I knew those colors were just completely out. Um, but I, one of my top guesses was the Dapple Gray. And sure enough, we got an adorable Dapple Gray uh, pony. This one's definitely going to be a girl. Uh, she's just so precious. I love her eye color. I've seen um, some of my followers, followers post. And she has like these beautiful light blue almost purple eyes and I'm just like oh they did such a good job and I, I can't even wait to see their animations I'm so excited uh, so we're gonna go ahead and get her and I already have a name picked out for her as well Chip. I felt the name was so fitting. I really wanted to do stuff with Winter, but the amount of horses that I have named Winter is like ridiculous. Uh, so I didn't really want to go with Winter or Frost. I really wanted to go with Ice because I don't have any horses with uh, the name Ice in it. Uh, so I think it really fits her like a nice chip, like a teeny tiny ice chip, chip of ice. So I think it's very fitting to her. So let's get our last one, you guys. Alright you guys, so we are going to look at their animations. Obviously, um, they still have the same standing animation, the same grazing animation, uh, but they are just so stinking cute. I just love the expressions. I love like how sassy they are. They are absolutely just sassy pants ponies and I love it. Uh, so we are going to see their animations. Alright, so here's the walk. It's a nice, even walk. Very much like a pony. So, let's see the trot. Oh, the trot's so cute. I just love the little head bob and head swing side to side. It's just, oh! It makes your heart melt. Like, my heart is, like, actually melting. Alright, so let's see the canner. A very nice, cute little canner. Not too out there. You know what? I didn't even notice. But there are uh, the white little chest mark. I completely forgot about that. Alright, so back to their animations anyway. Alright, so let's see. The slow gallop, really cute. Really collected, like a pony should be. And here's the gallop, and oh my god, look how cute! It is so cute, I like literally can't even stand it. It's just like so perfect. It's not, um, too elongated, it's very like collective pony, uh, gallop. Alright, so let's see the sliding stop. Oh, and they have like a little rainer's uh, sliding stop. Like I would hope they would. It's not like something too crazy. So let's see the jump. Oh, how cute. The only thing I don't like is that they open their mouths. Like almost like it's kind of like being forced. Um. But other than that, they're really stinking cute, you guys. So, oops, I didn't want to do that, but that's okay too. Um, let's see the backup. Oh, look how precious! Oh my god, so stinking cute. I like literally can't even stand it. All right, so let's see the rear. Oh my god, that rear. Hold on. 
That's such a cute... It's not over-exaggerated. I don't like, um, rears that are over-exaggerated. Kind of like the English Thoroughbred and, um, the Frisian, for example. But this is a nice, cute little pony rear. Oh my god, these horses. They're gonna make my heart burst. Oh, I'm very glad I bought all three. I have three more horses to try, but... Wow, I cannot talk it today, guys. Uh, I had three more horses to train, but that's all right. And they're normal horse speed now, so that's an added plus. So I don't mind. Do not mind at all. Okay, so I definitely want to look at mane and tail markings. Oh, the long mane's kind of cute. I, I really do like their pony manes, though. Hold on. Let me look at different angles and see... It's not on this side, is it? No, it's not. Alright, um... Yeah, I don't really... No, I, I don't like the long manes. It just feels, like, kind of weird. Like, you know, like, the older manes, they kind of feel well or weird. It doesn't feel tailored to them. Um, so yeah, that will be a no. And then there's a short mane, which is kind of cute. Uh, but this one I have to show you because there is a marking. And you guys might recognize this if you paid attention to the live stream. They have the um, little... Um, oh, what's it called? The little runestone marking on their neck. Now, if I liked the braids, I would totally um, go with this. Uh, but I don't. I really don't like any of the mane styles on the new horses. It doesn't feel right. Uh, but I love that marking. That's like such a cool little secret that they add into it. That they added into it. It's just, ah, I love it. All right, you guys, that is it for this week's update video. The ponies turned out so much cuter than I imagined. To be honest, I didn't even think I was going to even want to buy all three. And like a lot of people thought, um, I didn't expect them to be this low of a price. I expected them to be in like at least the 500s. At least. I wasn't expecting them to be in like the 300 star coins range, but they are, and I'm so glad to uh, hear that and see that, and it's they they turned out so cute. I'm so excited for more variations. I don't know if you guys remember from the live stream, but there was also a chance for a Zoni. I would love to see that, and the coolest thing about this breed is, it can be whatever um uh the the design team or us want. They can be a any, like, m unusual color, aside from, like, the obvious, like, uh, colors of the rainbow, like, green, blue, purple. Uh, that's just obvious, but they just turned out so stinking cute, and I'm in love. My heart is, like, bursting into a million pieces just looking at them. Um, so, yeah, you guys, that is it for this week's update video. As always, uh, keep positive. I will see you in the next video. Bye!